In today's video, I traveled back to the Aether Dimension. The Aether Dragon isn't even breathing any sort of fire on me. Look at that! We got a dragon of our own! No, the Aether Dragon isn't even breathing any sort of fire on me. There's still two more bosses that I have to find and fight. And the first one is right behind this giant gate. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. We've made it inside. The first challenge today is the slider. Oh my gosh, it's coming directly at me. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Please, don't, don't, we don't have to do this. Don't chop my butt. Please stop chopping my butt. Can I get out of here? I changed my mind. I don't want to do this. Would you leave me alone for two seconds? Oh guys, this is bad. Okay, but in the last episode, I did defeat another boss. So I got healing stones and I also got bandages that I should be able to use the heal myself today. After this boss, there's one final Aether Dragon that I need to defeat in order to conquer the Aether Dimension. This thing reminds me a lot of the Naga boss from the Twilight Forest Dimension mod. It can just chop any block. I can't get away. We're gonna have to waste another healing stone. I do also have custom Aether weapons like this, the Lightning Sword. We will spam lightning from the skies. You will not survive. Okay, I also have the Dungeon Dagger that poisons anything that I touch with it. Okay, so we're gonna poison it, use the Rainbow Sword, and then also light it on fire, use the Lightning Sword. I need to use my healing stone. We're running out of healing stones. I was hoping that I could maybe save these for the final Aether Dragon battle, but I guess this is uh, gonna have to be what happens today. Okay, that's fine. We're almost able to beat this thing. Oh my gosh, wait, we're so close. We're so close. I need to use the dungeon dagger and we have done it. We've defeated the third Aether boss. Bye-bye, slider. Oh my gosh, it dropped so many things. We got extra healing stones and we also got a brand new sword, the Phoenix Sword. Wait, that looks crazy. We can check out our weapon recipe Aether guide to see the Phoenix Sword. It deals 15 attack damage and you actually need eight Ambrosium ink gets to craft it, but we already did it. We already have this bad boy that does 15 damage. Can I get out of here now, please? May I go home? Do I have to mine you? Would somebody please let me out of here? The clouds are starting to get angry with me. Don't you even dare come down here. I will kill you. Oh, this phoenix sword is a god. All right, so I'll figure out how to get out of this place. Uh, Please go ahead and smash like with your left pinky toe. And while you're down there, if you haven't subscribed already, consider subscribing. The majority of people watching aren't actually subscribed, and I'm not sure why. It's free, and you could always change your mind later. I just have to, like, build my way out of here. I guess I could do that. We can use the mutated liver roots. That sounds like something that I would not want to eat. Well, okay, that seemed a little bit complicated to get out of the dungeon, but we've done it. Did it just open back up? It opens from the outside but as soon as you go in, you're locked inside. That's a weird system. The final Aether boss is found in this giant golden castle. I don't think I'm quite prepared for that yet, so we're gonna go over in this direction to explore a brand new biome. I'm hoping that I can find some more armor because I only have the Valkyrie chest plate. It's pretty good. It gives me two extra absorption hearts, but it's not gonna be enough. So let's go see what the Iridated biome has to discover. Oh, look at that, cute little bunnies. And over there in the distance, there's a village. Maybe we can find my friend, the villager trader. Ooh, very nice. There's pears here. I love a good pear bush. Huh, that's a weird looking chicken. Hello there, chicken nugget. Oh my gosh, you are not friendly. Okay, so sorry, you must die. I've spotted the villager trader. Do not run. Howdy, How, yes, is there something of interest? Well, yes, definitely. Uh, ooh, a magnetic sword. That does sound pretty interesting, but I'm looking for some armor. You have no armor. You are no use to me. You saw nothing. Maybe I can find something of value around the village. I'll borrow it for a little bit. I'll totally give it back. Nothing good in there. That's what you get for not having something good. What the flip is that thing? It's a magical lion dragon. Do you want to be my friend? No, you do not. Please don't do this to me. I've never seen a lion with wings. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, I want to tame you. Do you like meat? I will feed you meat. Oh, uh, what about carrots? Are you more of like a vegetarian lion? Even though I thought lions like to eat meat, but apparently not. I just want to be your friend. Please stop fighting me. How do I tame this thing? Okay, all right. I'm going to die before I figure out how do I tame this thing. Please stay down there. I know you have wings, but don't fly up here and try to kill me. Go kill that bunny. It looks juicy. Oh, this is the biome that we're in. It says a desert-like biome filled with fruitful leaves with pears, dangerous and hostile mobs with ravines and ores found on the walls of the islands. Well, you are hostile and dangerous. Therefore, you must die. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, wait. It dropped some more healing hearts. Another chicken! You're a friendly chicken. I'm gonna call you Colonel Sanders. Colonel Sanders, don't worry. I'll be back a little bit later after I go figure out what's over there in that beautiful looking village that I'm totally not gonna ransack and steal tons of things from. Every single village in the other dimension has the one of these guys. I thought it was just the same guy over and over again, but I guess he has a bunch of twins. All right, how you doing today? You have better trades than your brother? Honestly, not really. He does have a flame sword, which sounds pretty cool. Um, but I don't know if I want that right now. I kind of want to just buy some more Valkyrie armor. All right, so I found a pirate ship up there. At least I think it's an either pirate ship. And I see a chest. I feel like there's going to be some good things up there. So we're going to go destroy it. 
Well, after I collect the things up there. But then we will destroy it. Whoa, wait a second. Okay, I crafted a rainbow shovel so that I could collect some more blocks. And this thing is good. Oh, snap. It mines things quickly. 34. That should do the trick. This should do the trick. Twin them all. Oh, yeah, we definitely nailed this one. We're coming in hot. Hello. Is anybody here? And it doesn't look like it. All right, cool. Oh, we found a Valkyrie helmet. Oh my gosh, what are you? Oh wait, they drop coins too. Okay, let's put on the helmet. Oh, that is sweet. We get extra hearts too. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, I should probably destroy the spawners and you know like stop stealing stuff uh, while the spawners are still around. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. One spawner down. The Phoenix Sword is so overpowered. It can kill these little dudes in like two hits. I need to get a little bit lower here. There we go. Now we can open it. Oh, we found the Valkyrie boots. This is amazing. And we also got enchanted berries, which should be able to regen my health. Good for the Aether Dragon battle. The boots give me an extra set of hearts as well. And last but not least, we need to get the final chest on this side. Can I reach it? Yes, I can. And we found the last of the full Valkyrie set of armor. That is amazing. And more berries. I like berries. Hello, sir. Thank you so much for your contribution. Oh, yep. Now time to set the boat on fire. Just as I promised. I think we're now officially ready to discover the Cloud City and take on the Aether Dragon. I have my swords at the ready, I have my full set of Valkyrie armor, and a bunch of enchanted berries just in case I get hungry. It looks like there might be some custom chests here. Can I open this thing? Oh my gosh, a candy cane sword? Nice! What else do we have? Lots of bandages, more healing stones, the water vials are, I guess, okay. I don't really know what to do with them, so we're gonna leave them behind. What's that up there? I don't know if I want to find out. Oh, there's a spawner. Let's destroy that. I don't want to have to deal with any of the Aether Dragon's minions. This place does look amazing, though. Maybe after I defeat the Aether Dragon, we can go explore it, but this looks like the entrance. Will it open for me? What? It did. I didn't even have to tell it a knock-knock joke. I guess let's head inside. It looks like there's a portal up there. Let's see what happens if I just walk inside. Oh my goodness. It just came out of nowhere. It's summoning a minions. It's the Aether Dragon. Don't worry, guys. I have trained for this. We have the Phoenix Sword. We have the Lightning Sword. We can poison it using the Dungeon Dagger. I think we'll be okay. Our armor is insanely powerful. Look how much damage we do with the Phoenix Sword. Okay, we can also use the Enchanted Berries to give myself some regen. We might as well use them all at this point. This is the final battle of the day. Oh my goodness. Wait, we already have it down to half health. We are demolishing this thing. As cheap of dragons. It obviously was not going to go any other way. Okay, just to be safe, we'll use my healing stone. The Aether Dragon isn't even breathing any sort of fire on me. It's just stomping on me. We're actually going to be able to do this way faster than I thought. Did we do it? No way. We just defeated the Aether Dragon. What the flip is that? Uh, hi. Are you a unicorn? And wait. Oh my gosh, it dropped a full set of other Valkyrie armor. I guess we might as well replace my set because it got kind of beat up there. And we got the Aether Sword. The Aether Sword does 17 attack damage. This is easily better than the Phoenix Sword. And wait, it looks like it dropped an egg. Can we actually hatch it? Oh, snap! Look at that! We got a dragon of our own! This is amazing! Look, it's trying to attack this tiny cloud creature! While we're here, we might as well check out all of our trophies. We have the Aether Dragon Trophy, the Slider Trophy, the Golem Trophy, and last but not least, the Spirit Trophy. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed, subscribe if you guys are new, and comment down below what other dimensions I should conquer next time.